Alright, so I'm fighting Dracula. No biggie. Just normal day in the monster summoning neighborhood. I'm gonna try to petrify him though. Because if I can petrify him and then maybe throw a siren down, get some of those. Okay, at least took out that thing. Invincibility frames! Awesome! Seriously, I love invincibility frames on bad guys. It's awesome. It's just the best. Couldn't ask for more awesome game mechanic. At least I got my spinner, spinner monster to hurt him. Hopefully he doesn't heal, because that would really suck. Alright, you need to go away. Thank you. I missed. That would, that would have been a really good hit, but I missed. Alright, I'm gonna do another spin with the Juggernaut. I wonder if I can catch Dracula. Or Dracul, as this game calls him. Assuming he doesn't just dodge again. Why am I so slow? Alright, he's gonna dodge this. There's no way this is gonna hit. But I have to try. Okay, that went surprisingly well. That's not what I meant to do. I just want to catch you. Please let me catch you. That didn't work either. Oh, that... he healed. Are you serious? One health. And I'm out of cards. He's gonna... He's gonna kill me. And I just have to cut back to where I was trying to catch him like a stupid, stupid, stupid head. Alright, I'll cut back to where I am now. But with cards, actually. Oh, I found some old cheat music. So now I can hopefully play the organ over there and Get something? Anything? Oh, cool. So luckily I know how to play the organ. <laughs> that was interesting. Alright, come back here. Why are you just running? Really fast, I might add. Um, Alright, I'm just gonna throw the skeleton at him. Skeleton is... Okay, either the skeleton is good, or the nightmare is terrible. I'm leaning on the nightmare is terrible side, because I've seen... I've seen the skeleton be pretty bad, honestly. Anyway, what's in the secret? Bad guys, I should've known. Skeleton fight the water guy, and I'll try to take care of these guys. The nightmares. What did I just say, skeleton? Fight the thing you're good at fighting. Oh my gosh, skeleton. Alright, now you're doing it. 
Good job. Good job, Skelt. Oh, this looks like a... Maybe where Dracula would sleep? Please don't pop out and kill me. Fairies are born from the slivers of heart that break off when a human forgets what it is to love. The more a fairy hangs around a human, the bigger and smarter they become. So that's kind of sad. What? You're going to take me to be with others like me? All right. I was starting to think I'd be stuck in this place forever. Please don't be a bad guy. Please don't be a bad guy. All right. That's actually really cool. Hopefully, I could get something like the Mind Flare and the fight with Dracul and summon that. Although now that I think about it, that's probably just cards I've already used that that works for that. Either way, I need to actually win this so that I don't have to go through all that again. <laughs> Alright, Dracula's getting hurt. I'm kind of regretting doing this bush thing because it doesn't seem to be doing that much, honestly. Which is really disappointing, but... Yeah, it just died and I didn't see it actually do any damage. So, that's great. And I missed. Just gonna hit him again, pick up these. Kinda hurt, so I'm gonna use a fairy. Wish I could skip this animation. Um, throw a Caterpoker out there, do one of these, and... Can I catch him? Did I catch him? No. No, I didn't catch him. The Caterpoker must have killed him. Anyway, level cleared. Five stars, wow. Please get Dracula. How about you? And you. And you. Wow. I actually got Dracula. Well, I guess it's just Vampire. I wonder why they gave him a name at all. Why did they just say, hey, go Vampire? Anyway, um... I don't think I have enough fairies, but I'm going to give them to this guy anyway. Alexander, that's his name. I always forget that for some reason. <laughs> nope, that wasn't enough. Ten fairies become one large fairy. And maybe there are a hundred fairies in this entire game. That's interesting. There's pretty much no way I'm ever going to get all of them, though. At least on video form, unless people really want me to, I can figure it out. But I, I really don't think that's going to happen. I guess I'm supposed to go talk to Gerd again. I've got something interesting for you. Dot dot dot. I found an ancient scroll from a pagan religion. According to the scroll, the Enchanter was a name given to a king. The title was inherited. But no king in Argyle has ever used that title. That means there is another world out there. The scroll talks about five runestones, just as there are five runestones in our world. But then it says that a person owning all five runestones will receive a great power. The power guarded by the runestones, apparently. But who knows what the real truth is? I do know that you already have four runestones. There's only one thing for you to do. You must go to the Colosseum. To get the last runestone, apparently, is what she meant. I don't have any overwhelming urge to buy any of these, except maybe the Ice Golem, but that's really expensive. So I'm going to hold off on that. I don't really want to sell anything, I just want to keep going. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm going to keep going. I am, however, going to save and quit for now, because it's late and I need to <laughs> sleep. I got pretty far, and I'm happy with how far I got. 
So, thanks for watching, assuming you're watching. If you're not watching, you won't have heard me say thank you for watching. So, thank you for watching, and goodbye.